Welcome everyone to Side Draft and welcome to another diecast review. Emily, this one, you love this one. Yeah. One of your favorite diecasts that you own. What is it? That was Daytona Win. Daytona Win. Um, you know that race where he burnt down the track pretty much. Uh, um, he had a right exciting here. victory uh, celebration. Um, you can tell. Yeah, so it's right, right here on the screen now. Uh, first thing about this car that you'll notice is bright orange with the, the, the dull of gray and the black camo. And of course, that makes the Bass Pro Shops stand out on track. So I think it's uh, a good variation of colors there. And uh, you're, you're always going to be able to pick this car out on the track. And I do believe they'll be racing this one in 2021. So. You all get to see this beautiful car again, maybe even Victory Lane. Um, we got us a little dollar store of Victory Lane <laughs> made up now. Uh, but uh, this is the race win, as Emily said. Um, so race wins. Emily really liked this about the tire. The brake line car. Oh no, no. Uh, but, yeah, this camera doesn't really focus all that well, but you know the tire's got some some damage to it and. And that's why his, and it um, sets it apart from all the other diecasts. And that's why his, the track went on fire. So Black Rifle Coffee Company on the back, I'm trying to find a good spot for this focus, but it just doesn't want to. You know how cameras are; they don't really want to help you at all. But uh, got some. Uh, the camo looks really cool, and it's cool to see it up close on the diecast. Um, there's a little bit of of damage right here. Not sure if that's uh, shipping damage or uh, that actually happened on the track. And then, of course, if, if a little no, bit down here as well. If Noah's watching this, can you please tell us? Verify. Find the car and tell us. Uh, then, uh, you know, you get a lot of that grime uh, from the, the racetrack. And you got a little bit of that right there. And also the tape. Normally, uh, tape isn't something they put on regular diecast. So, race wins. You get tape. And... Uh, did you get confetti or the wind sticker with this one? Yeah. Just the wind sticker or the confetti? Just the wind. Just wind sticker. Yeah, they, they quit doing the confetti, I think. So that's a bummer. Uh, but uh, yeah, you can't really celebrate by throwing a little pack of confetti anymore. But uh. And this is my first victory lane car yeah, that I can open. Yeah, at the hood there, the big fish there, Bass Pro Shops, True Timber Camo. And uh, yeah, and then you got this up here, like in days in the super speedways, that have the little escape hatch. And uh, you know, if anything ever happens, they can just pop out of there. And, uh, and you got like a little dirt. Yeah, a little bit of dirt on it. And uh, I'm pretty sure right here, that's where the fire happened. Ooh, that's where the fire happened. That's where uh, Noah put his mixtape out on the track. But yeah. Beautiful and then car. It rained the next day. Just look at it in Victory Lane. Beautiful car. Yeah, and it, then it rained the next day, so he, he made the the heat from the flames create the rain. Now notice this on every one of Noah Gregson's cars. He's got the American flag. Uh, I'm not sure if that's Noah Gregson's choice or if that's a, a sponsor choice, but it's really cool. Uh, I noticed that by his uh, Lionel Racing car. And uh, which I got that one ordered. And it's going in my room. It's not coming for a while, but whenever it gets here, we'll it's review. It's going to be in my room. I believe this is the first Snow Gregson diecast that we're reviewing. Mm -hmm. so, and it's my first one that he has not signed. So signed the other two, but not. A lot of people has has noticed that uh, this is the same paint scheme as Chase Elliott's car. It's just got Noah's own little twist to it. I think it's even better than Chase Elliott's car. It is. It, it is with the camo and the colors they just pop like we said before and uh, really awesome die cast and this one was hard to find. We did find this at Fast Pro Shops and uh, took a while to get here for shipping because you know with the whole Christmas thing and I got it for Christmas I didn't know as well. I didn't know I was getting this. Ooh, okay seen what lighting was best uh, but um, you know the black rifle coffee we, we tried some last year uh, really great 
and yeah, awesome car. Emily, do you have anything else to add about this car? Well, the reason why it's awesome is because it has an awesome driver. Awesome driver, yeah. And if you have never met him, he's the nicest driver there is. Yeah, Emily is an O'Grixon super fan, if you haven't noticed already. But so. even if I wasn't, I would still say that. And so what sets this car uh, above all the others? Well, it's a win. It's a win. <laughs> and it's probably... Um, it's probably what? <laughs> And we do have a kind of connection with it because we saw it before it was on the video. Yeah, we saw it. We kind of saw parts of it before. We saw the, this part. Yeah, we saw the camo. Was oh my gosh, it's camo car. It's pretty cool, man. And then, and then they revealed it, and we was like, yeah, I knew it. <laughs> um, yeah, it's cool uh, to see that they're still with Noah for uh, this upcoming season and. Who knows, it might go back to back. And we never heard of Black Rifle Coffee until they started sponsoring Noah. Yeah, and that that's, uh, I believe it's, yeah, we still have uh, the box up it. there. They can't see it, but it's up there. Uh, <laughs> but uh, the camo is, I'm not quite sure what kind of design it is. It's, it's really different, but can't really make out what some of these things are, but uh, and now, it's really unique. And now I have a, the hauler of it. I mean, a lot of camo paint schemes just doesn't really and do it right, but this I part really, does it right. I really wish that they um, had like a little action figure Noah so we can put like some <laughs> on the hood. It'd be cool if they put like a little trophy, like what the trophy looks like. Cause that'd be cool. In, uh, the race wins as that'd well. Be, that'd be a cool display of no one just, you know, just fighting on the... Especially with the iconic tracks or wins like the Daytona 500, you get, you know, that iconic trophy. And I remember this day and I was almost going to hit the ceiling. Yeah, Emily, she was really excited that day. But yeah, another great diecast that uh, Emily is going to hoard in her <laughs> shelf. Uh, but, uh, we're trying to build the diecast vault right here. Uh, so the, for none of Noah's cars is going in this room. Em Emily's taking them all, so they're not going in my vault. But this whole room, I want to make it a vault one day. We got, we got plenty of space. If you, unless if Noah sent you the same diecast. Yeah, Noah, if you want to send me one so I can have one for my vault, that'd be great. Uh, but uh, another great diecast, and of course. This will be my favorite one we have reviewed. Yeah, we reviewed, yeah. A lot of great ones that we've reviewed so far, but Emily puts us at number one. Which one do you put at number one that we've reviewed so far? And the Monday after this, we met him. We met Noah. So what should be the hashtag for this video, Emily? Um, hashtag Noah is awesome. Yeah. So everyone in the comments below, comment hashtag Noah is awesome, and we'll give you a draft point for our fast pick series. If you're not sure what that and is, treat that to Noah. And tweet it to Noah on Twitter. Hashtag Noah is awesome. So uh, you'll get uh, a draft point and compete for the side draft shirt at the end of the season. And if you have not already choose a team, we'll probably put you in one. Yeah. Or if, yeah, if you haven't choose, chose a team yet, uh, you can choose either team, team Emily, Team Adam, or Team Steve. Steve wasn't with us uh, today. He's sick and working. So that's not, that's not a fun combination, is it? But... Uh, yeah, his work won't want to stay out. <laughs> yeah. uh, but great car, great paint scheme, and I uh, look forward to reviewing more Noah diecast and more and we race have, wins alike. We have two more of his cars too. Yes, we do. Yeah. So uh, subscribe. Stay tuned for that. We're heading our way to 900 subscribers. We're at 891. And we're reviewing a nine car. Yeah, nine for 900. Come on, guys. We need to make it there. So. Thank you all for watching. If you want to stay in the draft, you can click that big red subscribe button because you got to stay in the draft to stay Daytona, right? So we'll see you in the next video.